Fuck off. This morning we left uh, Bangladesh Beach Camp and we're just on the road down to, it sort of goes towards Hope Town. And then we're gonna tuck back in uh, to Mason's Bay. Hopefully there's, it's a first in, first serve sort of kind of campsite. So hopefully we timed it around lunchtime and we'll get in there, someone's left in the morning sort of deal. It seems to have worked so far, but it is a Friday, so we're good. And as is making his way down uh, the Sabo, and he's gonna spend a couple of days with us down there. My cousin also works on a farm very close to Mason's Bay. So we'll hang there around three or four nights at least, um, catch up with him, go get some yabbies. Uh, so that's about it. Mason's Bay, bit of killing, <laughs> bit of camping, bit of drinking. Yeah. Well, we've made it to um, Mason's Bay. Um, it's good, we got a pretty good campsite. There's lots of little ones here. But um, we managed to find one fairly decent size. We can park the ute, got the van in the back and heaps of room for the tinny. So we're just dumping the van here, having a feed, uh, take the tinny off and duck into Hope Town. It's 20 or 25 k's away and then come back in. Um, just to grab some food because we're pretty much low on everything. We had a look down the beach before and it's great. So uh, the beach is only about 30 meters that way. And there's a big bay that comes in. Fuck off. Hello. Oh, hello mate. What's going on? Have you been dodging kangaroos? Uh, echidnas. Just uh, thought over to look at the echidna. That's awesome. Oh, that's great. Um, how far away are you? Oh, uh, one kilometre. Oh, lovely. Uh, we are, I can see your headlight. Um, we're, yeah, come down the road and there's a no entry sign but we're the first caravan just in there if you want to pop in there. Okay you want me to break the law already? Yes that's correct over. Yeah we'll wave a head torch at you. I'll um I'm wa waving head torch. See head torch? I see head torch. Over. Copy. Over. Follow head torch. Aaron's here. over again. <laughs> <laughs> Left, fucking right. Yeah, How's the serenity? Uh, we're on the back of the reef out near Mason's Bay. And we can take a little look for some abalone. I might uh, walk over those rocks over there. See if I can grab a herring or two. Very slippery. And I've got my heat waves on again. That's how I stacked it last time. Um. 
go see if Aaron's having any uh, luck. See if I can make my way over here without stacking it big time. Baron. Baron. Hey Aaron, do you know what those birds are? <laughs> close. He wasn't close. Uh, no abalone here and no herring. Might just make me way back to the boat. <laughs> Left-handed. <laughs> you can. Oh, it's a big herring. It's coming like, at you. Yeah, coming in. <laughs> Whee! She's on. The last one. Nice. No landing in there, Aaron. So don't fuck up. I might have a double headers. Yeah. Oh. What? Oh, I had a bit of weed. weed. Skippy. Oh. <laughs> well, Skippy. <laughs> Skippy on the trawl. Do you need me to chuck it in reverse? Let's chase it. Max. Oh. oh. You still got it? Yeah. Oh, we got multiple. Oh. Oh. Damn it. No. I think we can get a couple on there. Still got one? I think so. Yeah. Try for weed now anyway. That's <laughs> a crazy one. Still on? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got probably double headers going on. What's going on here? Something Oh, Skippy. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. Buddy. Skippy on the trawl. Ha! He's taking the little one. Too. Sandy too, eh? Oh, yep. Oh, oh, yeah. oh here we go. No, no. He's on, he's on. Big time. Oi! Big beauty. Alright. Running out of beach. One, we got a little bit more time. <laughs> That's it. Three herring. Mm -mm -mm. Fuck off. Uh, yeah, Aaron left um, just a minute ago. He came down for the weekend. Went out and got some yabbies this morning. Uh, my cousin, he works on a farm just over a few k's over the back there, which is pretty handy. So yeah, we chucked some nets out last night. Um, got probably uh, I don't know ten liters of yabbies. So we cooked them up just before, uh, so it was pretty good. I'm just peeling some um, yabbies. Aaron's got the uh, technique. 
Remove the poo tube. Wow, that's the go. Four minutes. Start. Look at that. Just a ladle of goodness. Oh, that looks lovely. Yep. Fuck off. Your cousin gave me a big slab of um, elk meat, which they they have some wild elk that float around here from back in the day where someone had an elk farm and um, and let them go wild. So yeah, he shot one not long ago and gave me a big slab of elk meat, which I'm going to get old um, bucket of bill back out. So yeah, it's going to make some bill time. We're probably going to leave here in a couple of days, so. It'll probably take four days with this temperature to properly um, cure. But um, after a day or so, you can travel with it in the bucket and it won't stick together. So you're just gonna slice this up into steaks, probably, I don't know, 20 mil thick. So yeah, I've just put a bit of uh, brown malt vinegar in there already and cut them fairly thick. And just got a bit of old, Worse the shear. Get a bit of that in there. Lovely. Just turn them over and I'll put them in the fridge for a couple of hours. Then turn them all over and then do a couple more hours. And then we'll start the spicing process. Chuck them in the fridge very gently. Sweet. So the meat's been in the fridge for a couple of hours. So we can take it over and just flip it all over. Yeah, then just put them back in the fridge for a couple more hours if you want. And then um, I'll put the spices on them. I'm going to drain out all the brown malt vinegar and Worcestershire sauce. And then put the dry rub on it, which is just um, coriander, seed, pepper, salt, and I added some barbecue seasoning in there. So it's pretty much done. Uh, this one I added a bit more um, steak seasoning, like a steak rub, and a bit more pepper. See how it goes. Put that back in the fridge, and then we'll put it in the bucket o bill. Oh, well, I'm gonna get this cranking inside because it's blowing its head off outside at the moment. But I've got old uh, bucket o bill ready to roll. So I'll chuck it on the hooks on the bucket and get that cranking. Kel's my master apprentice. And we've got it all hanging up. I've even had to hang a bit off a bit. And uh, it's gonna drip down in the bucket there for the first day or so. But I should be right. And yeah, just lower it down. And as long as it's not all touching, should be sweet. Good job. Right, get in there. And Milwaukee 5000. Oh. Yeah, I'll check it in the morning and uh, make sure no meat is touching each other. Should be all good. Do you like Biltong? I do. <laughs> uh, we're just out uh, just for a bit of a trawl. Why not with these um, lovely conditions? Yeah, we just thought uh, I'd pop out for an hour or so, have a little trawl up and down this um, sandy patch and see what we can get. It's great. Wait till we go back into the wind. Oh! Kel's on. <laughs>
Oh, you're on this one. Oh. You're ah. Double hook up. Ah, you let go. Just keep the fight. Three more for a feed. Girls, um, get, the, get the job done. Into the wind we go. Two more. Come on, Kelly. Need to go in. Yep. Bang, bang. Oh, we're on. Don't fuck up. Yeah. Oh, Skippy. That's sweet. Oh, we got eight. Uh, so we're going in. Yeah, the fuck home. <laughs> <laughs> we'll troll on the way back in, but um, yeah, we're going to get soaking wet. That was a successful mission. We wanted eight for a feed, and eight we got. So I'll, um, I'll just duck down on the beach and fill them up. Just got the yabbies that we uh, caught the other day, and we boiled them up yesterday, and just gonna peel them, and then Kel's gonna make a special pasta. I'm gonna try. Yabby pasta. No guarantees, this is kinda just chuck some shit together and hope for the best. Oh, no, it's pretty good. Oh, peel. Debbie's are peeled and Kels is heating up some uh, butter and in the fry pan with a bit of salt and pepper. Um, chuck the yabbies in the fry pan with a bit of mixture, heat them up and then put them in the pasta with the mm. pesto. Yes. And that when it's all done. All done. Very nice. I hope it tastes as good as it smells. It smells good. <laughs> It'll taste pretty good, I reckon. There you go. Thank you. Welcome. Uh, taste test. Gotta get a yabby. Hang on. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> pretty good. That was pretty tasty. Nice. Nice.